What's going on traders? Welcome to Investing Trends where we talk about the latest news and trades on trending stocks. Welcome back to the ARK Invest series where we track the daily activity of the popular ETF ARK Invest. If you don't know who Kathy Wood is or why ARK Invest is such an amazing ETF, then watch this first video of the series by clicking the suggested link above. That being said, let's take a deep dive into their daily trading activity for this week and insights into their specific holdings. Here, we have a list of all the stocks that they bought or sold. Overall, ARK Invest was selling more shares on Wednesday and Thursday of this week, with a huge buy on Friday 13th, with a net increase of 1 million shares, which we will find out exactly which stocks Kathy Wood bought. Some interesting insights and trends I want to point out to you as we scroll down. ARK has been consistently buying repair therapeutics they have not sold a single day within the recent weeks. On the other hand, they have been selling nanostring technologies where they haven't bought a single day within the recent weeks. Both of these stocks have very low trading volume, so are trading a net amount of shares in the hundred thousands for both of these shares is a pretty big deal. And of course, the consistent buying or selling trends speaks louder and is the key here to consider. ARK Invest is still not confident in Douyu International and continues to sell off its shares having sold close to 1.2 million shares just this past week alone. And as you can see, we are tracking some of the bigger tech companies such as Slack, Netflix, PayPal, Roku, Snap, and Twitter. There are small purchases in Roku, but other than that, not much trading activity for these giant tech companies. Kathy Wood has been selling Exxon, ticker symbol XONE, for the last consecutive 7 trading days. This stock is not trending very well, and the volume is very low with only 300k trading volume, so the net trading shares of 150k is pretty significant. I would be concerned if I was a shareholder of this company. Now, this is the one I've been waiting for. This is a pretty big deal. Palantir reported earnings on November the 12th, and I wanted to see whether ARK was going to sell Palantir or buy more. If you don't know what Palantir is and why it is significant, you can check out my earlier video on Palantir by clicking on the recommended link above. So what did ARK Invest do here? They bought, and they bought a lot more shares. On Friday, they bought over 1 million shares which is the majority of the shares ARK Invest bought on Friday in total. ARK is bullish in Palantir. Now remember, just because ARK Invest buys the stock doesn't mean that the stock is going to go up. The share price could go down and can go down for several days in a row, so I'll be watching the stock closely. 1 million shares is a lot, but it is only a one-time purchase. I'd like to see how they trade the stock in the coming week. But so far, ARK Invest is bullish on Palantir in my books. If you're a fan of ARK Invest or just simply want to learn more, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel right now. That way, you don't miss out on their latest trades or investing trends of their specific holdings. Just click on the subscribe button below this video. Cyrus Pharma is not looking good with ARK having sold off 1.7 million net shares where the trading volume of the stock is only a mere 360k. Kathy Wood is just selling this stock day after day after day, so watch out. Same with Series Therapeutics, not a good sign here. And this week, they just started selling off Compugen again, with a total of 162,000 shares sold just this week alone. I know a lot of you are interested in these big name companies, such as Pinterest, Fastly, Apple, Amazon, and their recently hyped up stock, Workhorse. I know a lot of traders that got into Workhorse just because Kathy Wood did. The stock had a major correction with the whole USPS contract rating game, but has been slowly going back up. But ARK Invest just bought 96,000 shares on November the 2nd, just one day, and no buying or selling activity ever since. And Alibaba was a pretty big news this week and wanted to check out what ARK Invest would do with Baba, but they just sold some shares on Friday and nothing too serious here. So as you can see, ARK Invest bought into Nintendo for four days in a row this past week. Now, this is a very logical trade for me and I decided to follow this trade and bought into Nintendo myself. 
For those of you who may not know, Kathy Wood is very bullish on this holiday season where Nintendo will benefit a lot as consumers will buy and gift the popular Nintendo Switch console game. You have to realize that the Nintendo Switch is trending among the consumers and gaining traction dominating the US console sales compared to the PlayStation and Xbox. And there's a report saying that the Nintendo sells a record of 735,000 Switch consoles just in October. The Nintendo Switch just sold more units in Q3 than any console in a decade. Who knows, maybe you'll be getting a Nintendo Switch for this holiday season. In addition, you know that famous game Pokemon Go that had the world roaming around the streets with their eyes glued to their phones and falling into pitfalls? Well, a lot of people are still playing this game and Pokemon Go is having the best year ever. In the year 2020, the game has grossed over $1 billion in revenue, making it the best year ever for the game in terms of revenue. The game is the third largest mobile game for revenue behind PUBG and Honor of Kings, two mobile games from Tencent Holdings. Remember, Ark Invest has also been buying Tencent. To top it all off, Nintendo Switch did something crazy. It blew my mind. We all know someone who has never played video games and is just bad at games, right? Well, my brother is just that person. And he just texted me that he's getting a Nintendo Switch out of the blue. Nintendo just defeated the ultimate boss and this stock is looking good for me. Lastly, they are on a buying trend for Castle Biosciences, ticker symbol CSTL. That's it for this video. I hope going through ARK's activity has given you additional insight to how they are thinking about the stock you're holding or any new stock ideas that you want to learn more and enter. Let this be a guide to how you navigate your trades and long-term investing to reach financial freedom. Please invest safely, subscribe to the channel, and hit that like button. I thank you, appreciate you, and see you next time.